Hello everybody and welcome back to Promise Gaming and more Plague Inc. Evolved Custom Scenarios! Last time we did the Nazi Zombies, which is pretty good. So, what do we want to do next? Do we want to try the Despair Worm? I think we want to try the Despair Worm. You take control of Junko and Oshima as you spread the ideals of despair throughout the world. Will you consume the entire world with despair or will hope triumph after all? Yes, I know how cheesy this sounds. It's based off the popular visual novel series Dagana Rampa? I actually could not tell because I've never heard of this before. Okay, another scenario where I'm going to basically have complete ignorance going into this. Hopefully those who are actually familiar with this will be able to give a better judgment as to whether or not this uh, scenario does justice to the source material, but okay. Custom descriptions for everything except for transmissions, because I honestly couldn't think of anything else. Mm, what's this? This scenario also should have a custom win scenario, but for some reason nothing popped up. I don't know why. I tried everything I could. If anyone knows why, could you please send me some feedback on how I can fix this? Hmm, okay. Not sure I'll be able to help you just without knowing the coding of it, but we can certainly take a look at it. Nurax Worm. ATP boost Darwinist, Terrocyte, Extreme of File, Symptostasis, all pretty good. We're not going to do on Mega Brutal today. Let's go for... It's Element 115 again? Um, I just... I guess we'll just call it Despair? There, we'll just call it Despair. Now, what's the difference? What is this source material? Is there actually, like, a manifestation of Despair versus Hope? I don't know. But... Let's just go into a blind and see if it makes any sense. Ever since you were born, nothing gives you joy except for despair. Despair gives you joy? That seems a little bit like an oxymoron, doesn't it? But okay. And now, with the help of your twin sister, period, you will spread that joy of despair into every single person on Earth. I have a twin sister? Okay. Junko Enoshima enrolled in Hope's Peak Academy alongside her sister, Mukuro. Will this be the beginning of the end? Probably. Despair begins in Japan. I mean, is this is this where I basically talk about how, you know, Japan having one of the highest suicide rates in the world and stuff? Maybe this is actually, you know, realistic in some way? I don't know. I mean, maybe not. So, transmissions. We have water. Pathogen can survive. Okay, so the author said that they wanted to create custom descriptions as much as possible, but it does look like a lot of these are some of the uh, generics, which is fine. Nothing wrong with that. We have blood, we have insect, we have air, and we have Despair Propaganda 1. Broadcast transmissions with subliminal messages converting people into despair. I guess we'll go ahead and start with that. I mean, why not? Everything else is a little bit more expensive, but that only costs two DNA points. Symptoms. Stage 1. Denial. Yep, that sounds about right. The host begins to feel despair a lot more than usual, but denies it and still clings on to hope. Slightly increases infectivity. I guess there's supposed to be an irony in whatever the source material is that somebody who's so, um... I mean, again, I don't, I don't know the relationship to despair is like an actual manifestation or not, but somebody who is so entwined with despair is uh, enrolled in a place called Hope's Light. There's definitely supposed to be an irony there, I can tell. Uh, we have cold resistance, heat resistance. Drug resistance will be important because we're starting off in Japan. And then killing games. Start killing games across the world to infect countries with despair. Trojan Plains. Killing games. Hmm, okay, sure, why not? Uh, yeah, let's actually go for that drug resistance really early, uh, just because I know that I'm going to forget otherwise, and that's really crucial if we want to have any chance in Japan. I think I also want to go for the rats kind of early on, because Japan is considered urban, so that would make some sense. Always want to have a good, um, a good set of resistances and transmission bonuses in your host country if you can. Canadians celebrate the Hey Herbert Treaty, waking them part of Alaska, which is the game's way of justifying why Alaska is not technically a part of the USA. Let's go for the rodents. Let's go for, uh, I guess we'll go for the water, since we are on an island. Uh, seems like we got a pretty substantial boost to DNA kind of early on. I mean, we only have a 10, 20, you know, like uh, 50,000 people infected, and I feel like we're actually getting around surprisingly well. Let's go ahead and grab that uh, air transmission so we can get on airplanes a little bit sooner as well. Stage one, denial. Okay, I didn't even have to. I didn't even have to uh, mutate that myself. You know, it just sort of happens. I'm despairing. Well, this is just a natural path. You're going to deny it. There. Stage two, a acceptance. The host immediately accepts despair and will spread it to anyone and everyone. You seem kind of depressed. No, I don't. Well, yeah, I guess I am. You should be too. That makes sense. Stage three, a sadistical. The host becomes sadistic and starts killing each other to feel more despair. Wow, that escalated quickly, and it costs practically nothing, by the way, thanks to Symptostasis. Might be a little bit overpowered. Or we have instead Stage 2B Depression. So we can progress from acceptance. We accept the fact that we're despaired, 
and that depresses us. Increases infectivity slightly. Not sure that's going to be all that useful. Might be better to continue working down transmission vectors if we can. I'm curious what is here in the middle. You know, stuck here in the middle with you. Um, could be something pretty good. I guess since we are actually getting around pretty quickly here, we should continue working down, down the water and air transmissions. Uh, because those are going to be a little bit more potent for us now that we've actually gotten out of the country. Probably start with Air 2, to be honest. Air 2 is pretty good. It's only slightly cheaper, but should get us around pretty easily. Yeah, we're definitely having no trouble with that. I mean, <laughs> this is one heck of an effective Nurax worm, I can tell you that much. We are getting around the world, no problemo. There we go, water, okay. So I guess the only way to get to the center, then, is to get everything around it, which somehow... Somehow, I imagine we are going to run out of gas long before I'm able to do that. Let's go for the despair. That leads to stage 3B, aggression. The host becomes aggressive after being given endless amounts of despair, slightly increases lethality. Could do that, but instead I'm going to go for the killing games and unlock a level of the Trojan Plain so we can start getting around to a few nations that we are going to be missing. They finally detected us after making a billion depressed people in China. That seems to do the job. Do we need some more resistances? I mean, we could do that, but I don't feel like I'm having a lot of trouble getting around to begin with. I also don't feel like we need more uh, Trojan Planes. Killing games now feature adults, not just teens. Is this becoming televised? I have no idea. Sounds like the Hunger Games, but whatever. So we could go down the uh, sadistical or the aggressive route. Let's see, what are we missing? Madagascar, the Caribbean, and everything else is a land connection. Might be okay. Let's go for despair propaganda. Oh, it does lead to something. Despair video! Upload the brainwashing despair video worldwide, forcing everyone to see it and making them fall into despair. Only 7 DNA, incredibly infective. Glad that I found that. Nothing else will matter. We can absolutely start going down the route of lethality. Let's do that now. Stage 3A to sadistical. Let's also grab addiction. I'm oh, sorry, uh, uh, aggressive. There we go. Insanity, 4A. The host becomes absolutely insane from despair. Increases severity. Again, very cheap thanks to the symptostasis. The symptostasis might actually be a little bit overpowered. Stage 4B, hard acceptance. The host accepts his despair and is slowly driven mad by it. Slightly increases infectivity and severity. I mean, at some point, doesn't this sort of sound like these two already? You know, I mean, what really distinguishes this route from the other? I feel like you can do them both in parallel because the, the author needed more symptoms. But overall, does it really add a lot more onto it? I mean, I don't know, maybe. Maybe a little bit. We'll go for hard acceptance. This leads to 5A, bloodlust. The host becomes even more sadistic, giving them a bloodlust that can't be satisfied, greatly increases lethality. From a grammatical perspective, uh, I will say that the one downside, the one trap this author seems to be falling into is uh, an overuse of periods instead of commas. You know, the host becomes more sadistic, comma, giving them a bloodlust that can't be satisfied. That would be more appropriate, but okay. Stage 5B, despair again. Oh, I guess, okay, maybe not again, I guess we've always been working with despair, but this is the real despair. The host becomes fully engulfed in despair, however, but I won't tell you until you grab it first, haha, -ha, there we go, suicide! The host cannot take any more despair, the only way out, suicide, required to unlock win symptom. Okay, and bloodlust probably will lead to something else down here as well. Uh, I think getting to 27 DNA should be really no problem at all, and is there any reason not to kind of go for some early lethality considering how infective we are? I'd say no. That is a reasonable amount of lethality. We can accept that. Bloodlust leads to torture. The host now relies on torturing others to feel the delicious despair, because don't forget, despair means joy. Also, greatly increases lethality, required to unlock the wind symptom. So you really do have to work down both paths in parallel if you want to have a good chance at this. Uh, we are still missing Morocco, so let's go ahead and go down there. Bingo. Need 25 DNA. That should be no problem. Never mind, we got torture for free. That unlocks the ultimate despair! The entire world is full of chaos and anarchy, and they all worship one person, Junko Enoshima. Or Enoshima, or however you pronounce that stuff. I mean, if you haven't watched my EU4 Japan series, I think you all know that I don't know how to pronounce anything in Japanese. That's the win. 30 DNA. Do we even have to infect anybody else? Because if we can just grab this right now, that was a very, very quick and easy scenario. Germany begins to break down. I'm looking for the pop-up that says you win. Mm, no. Okay. Hmm. So yeah, I'm guessing this is where the author is saying they're having some trouble with uh, custom win conditions. I, it's been a long time since I've worked on this, so I believe there's supposed to be a way to create a custom win condition and then tie it to the symptom, so when you get it, it starts a trigger. 
which then ties into the winning condition. A lot of other people have figured it out. Um, maybe I need to do a quick check and see if I can figure out how this works. I'll try. We'll see if it works or not. Let's go ahead and just sort of reset the cure a little bit. Looks like you have to go a long way around to try and get this whole kill a foundation member thing. What? Assassinate Juzo Sak Saka Sakakura with the ultimate boxer gong? What's the foundation? Apparently there's this thing called a foundation here. There may actually be some story. In fact, Byakuya... <laughs> Byakuya Togami, with despair, his influence in the future foundation will sabotage most plans. In fact, Kyoko Kiragiri, Kiragiri, with despair, her reputation as the ultimate detective will allow her to make false leads. In fact, Makoto Naigi... Oh god, I, I should just give up, right? This is going to earn me some serious dislikes on this video, just for not being able to pronounce Japanese, despite the fact that I don't know anything about the language. <laughs> because that's how people work on the internet. That's just how it works. Assassinate someone else, a pharmacist. So apparently we have like an ultimate, uh, I don't know, whatever the, the foundation thing is. We have an ultimate detective. We have ultimate hope, ultimate boxer, ultimate pharmacist, and then a leader of some foundation that I have no idea what that is because I'm not familiar with the source material, but that's it. Huh. I mean, okay. We need some more transmission. Uh, let's go for blood insects. Let's just go for both of those. Help us spread a little faster in Africa. Yeah, that certainly seems to have helped. Greenland we are still having some tr trouble with. We should probably go down a bit more of a Trojan Plains route. Uh, Killing Games has several new exciting despairful elements added to it, like a bomb that will explode if no one kills someone in five days. It definitely sounds like some sort of a sadistic ripoff of a Hunger Games. Is that how it's supposed to be? We're also killing too fast in Greenland. Gosh dang it, now I have to freaking devolve... I have to devolve? <sighs> devolve the suicide, because the, the, the custom scenario isn't the uh, isn't working, right? So now you have to actually infect the world. Yeah, okay, that's a little bit frustrating. I, I understand that. I can understand why the, uh, the author's a little bit, well, despairing, I suppose, over his scenario not working as intended. Huh, okay, I guess I should go ahead and kind of zoom forward on this, because at this point, all we're doing is just sort of sitting back and waiting for Greenland to get fully infected. Okay, so there are no healthy people left in the world, and it looks like Ultimate Despair does, in fact, create some sort of a unique condition here, so I guess we're actually fine. I did restart the scenario because Iceland didn't actually get fully infected, Then it turns out it's okay. You did it, you successfully destroyed every single last bit of hope in, every, uh, in everyone and successfully infected everyone with despair. Now everyone can share the joys of despair. Great work, you psychopath. So, I mean, was that not the, was that not the uh, custom win condition? I mean, it's basically the same as, you know, the Transcendence victory, but, I mean, seems to have worked. So if there was supposed to be another one, then it's hidden, and I'm not really sure what it's supposed to be. But oh well. There we go. I mean, 153,000 points, uh, 3 stars, 276 days. Seems okay. I don't know. I'm not really sure what the problem is. I was going to look for a solution, try to dig through the code of the uh, custom scenario editor and try to figure out what's going on, but... I don't even really see the problem, so, okay, I guess you must have fixed it, in which case you may want to update the uh, description for this scenario. Otherwise, though, as far as the scenario itself, I mean, yeah, there's a fair bit of customization involved in all of this. I guess I'm just not really in a position to judge the source material and say if it was uh, really accurate to the whatever this visual novel stuff is. So, people down in the comments section, you're going to have to let me know if you think that was any good, but otherwise, I mean, the scenario itself seems fine. Doesn't seem too bad. I just uh, wish that I knew a little bit more about it. So, I mean, is it good? Is it something I ought to read? I don't know. This guy probably thinks so. Del's Kibara. Yeah, all right, why not? Well done. Thank you very much for this scenario. Appreciate it. Thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Be sure to hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.